Hey guys, welcome back to Rossoneri TV. I'm June. I'm here for a new video to bring you the latest news going on at AC Milan. Now, in today's news, Milan apparently received an offer from Liverpool in which involved a swap deal between Niang and Balotelli. In other words, Liverpool wants Niang, and in return, they're telling Milan that they could keep Balotelli as they don't want anything to do with him. Now, Milan's response was a straight up no. Thankfully, because you just never know with this management, they might actually accept something so ridiculous like this. And uh, one of the reasons as to why they said no is uh, also because Nyang's value is 12 million euros, and that is more than what Balotelli is worth at the given moment. Now, Nyang was having a positive season prior to his car accident in late February, where he scored eight goals and added five assists in 20 appearances in all competitions. And uh, Liverpool and Tottenham scouts are expected to be present during the Coppa Italia final this Saturday against Juventus to observe Niang. On the other hand, Balotelli scored only three goals and added one assist in 22 appearances in all competitions. So a pretty disappointing season for Mario. And uh, there are now reports that suggest that Spanish club Espanyol are also interested in signing him on a free loan at the end of the season however on the contrary to Milan they are willing to pay his wages and that is something that Liverpool could definitely look at in terms of uh, which team Balotelli will end up to uh, this summer now in terms of this whole swap deal that was rejected by Milan I'm happy that they did that because I mean it would just be so stupid and ridiculous if they actually accepted something like this I mean Yang is a player with so much potential I like his work ethic and uh, some people are actually saying that if that car accident didn't happen he would have continued as a good form with Baca and uh, we would have potentially been in a different position at the end of the season so I think Nyang definitely still has a lot to give to this team and uh, I'm curious to see what he could do if he plays during the Coppa Italia final. I'm not expecting any miracles from him as he's been off for a long time but uh, it would be nice to see some uh, positive actions from him and also I'm curious to see how uh, he could react in next season because we really didn't see much of him this time uh, so uh, I'm curious to see what he could still do for Milan so definitely I think we should keep Niang at all costs Balotelli I don't know how much more he could offer to us uh, I think that uh, really he hasn't given us the certainties that we needed so if we could keep him for free then I wouldn't mind but if Liverpool are asking us to pay up for him or something like that then I think it's time to let him go but let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what do you think about this whole swap deal would you prefer seeing uh, Balotelli at Milan or not and also do you think Niang has a bright future ahead of him uh, for his time at Milan so let me know in the comment section below guys don't forget to subscribe to Rossoneri TV to stay updated with everything related to AC Milan on a daily basis and I'll catch you guys later for another video. This has been Gio setting off and as always Forza Milan. Genoa are keen on extending Suso's loan deal for yet another season.